Hey guys, we're gonna be going over how to get your dog in tune with chasing things and getting that drive to him just to wanna get whatever you throw in your hands or get him to be chasing ducks. So when I first got Max, he was probably about four months old, four and a half months old, and it was a puppy. And it was hard for him to start chasing things and bringing it back to me. So what I did, since he was a small puppy, this is all he wants to do. He doesn't really like to be pet. He just wants to have something in his mouth and chase and bring it back to you. That's all he wants to do. So sit. So this is how I did. I got a, I got a hallway right here. I shut all the doors in the hallway. Every single door in this long hallway. So when he was a puppy, he had nowhere to go except come back to me. So Max, come here. So he run down the hallway, grab that tennis ball, and come right back to me every single time. Give, give, give. And then I throw it right back down the hallway. Every single time I got him in this repetition, repetition of this drive, I wanted him to go retrieve. Give, give, and here. Here, sit, sit, good. Max, come here. We did this after nine, after nine, after nine, after nine, when he was a small puppy. And you know, sometimes you didn't want to go get it. So you had to go pick that dog up, carry the dog to the bumper, the chew toy that you had, tennis ball, and make him put that tennis ball in his mouth and make him enjoy it. Make him, all he wants to do is whoop, go get that match. And then nine after nine after night, you have to get him in this drive. And this is all he wants to do. This is what he's made to do. He could do this all day long. And get, 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 get. Good, good, give, give. The best thing here, well, here, good, sit, sit, good. He's, he's having a heyday right now, sit down, sit down. Before outside, he's more sturdy if I use a bumper because he knows we're not playing, but this is more of a play time for him. Oh, go get it, now, fetch it up, come on. Max, go get it, good. I try to get him sturdy, so he only goes on his name. Good, give, give, good, here. Good, sit, good. Nine after nine after nine, we did this until he literally passed out and then we woke up in the same spot the next morning and did this and did this and did this until he took a nap in the afternoon. Max, do it. But if you want that dog that's obedient and you want him to have that drive, here Max, come on Max. You want him to have that drive. Hey, come on here, turd. Let's go. Good, yeah. And all he wants to do is bring something back to you. That's all he wants to do is retrieve. Because that's how I brought him up. Sit down. Good. Max, go get it. So that's how I got my dog to hit, get his drive. Simple things like this. Just simple things. Shut all the doors in the hallway. Yep. Get a toy. And make him retrieve it. Even though he doesn't want to retrieve it, he's got nowhere to go. You're blocking this entrance right here. He's got nowhere to go except right back to you with the bumper in your hand. And he could do this all day long. That's the drive. So once he got that reward and he petting him and he liked that attention, that's all he wants to do now. It's just retrieve, 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 retrieve. So yeah. Get yourself a five-gallon bucket. That's what I did. You just sat here all night. And uh that's what I did. Good boy.